reason I haven't really been playing other shit so far. Maybe, maybe split two. I might do a no cloud account, but we'll see. I mean, I think Renekton's fun, it's just, I don't have a ton of, like, motivation to play League off stream, and when I'm streaming, I usually just play Cloudera. That's kind of what I'm branded around. So. Maybe, maybe in the summer, when I'm, I'll probably be streaming more in the summer, or like, grinding more in the summer, after the semester's done for school. A lot more free time, maybe. I'll think about it, but for the most part, yeah, it's it's just gonna be more just chilling. That's a fun champ. Yeah. I mean, Clever Necton played pretty similar. Obviously, build path wise, it's a little different, but in lane, it's like pretty similar. That's why I enjoy both. I'm assuming he's gonna start and land. Be here. I'm gonna ward just in case, because I've been getting level 2 cheesed a lot by uh, Volley Bears. Okay, never mind. He started his red, it looks like, actually. I blind picked Aatrox, so I'm assuming he's an Aatrox man. Gonna play for real. Uh, I'm fine with sacking some minions just to get a really good trade here. I'll just level my W. Man, that's fine. You should be dead. Way's not even bad either. Just cause they're our team, don't mean we can trust them. I should have flashed earlier. I held my flash too long there. I could have bought a call actually though. Maybe call would have been better. That's a who's true. Hey, how's it going? Uh the Rione? A Ron? Rony? A decent start though. Could just be dead here. Ah, yes, flash, never mind. I forgot he didn't flash. Whatever, I mean, his lane's over. Oh, that Q mess.
we just leave the wave like this because i still have tp as well so when he comes back i'm just gonna take another aggressive trade and then reset like he's so fucked He has bone plating here, but it doesn't matter. He's just losing so much to us. I could technically just TP in. I'm pretty sure I can just kill him anyways. Fucking nice. Yeah, he's just dead at 6. I have, uh... I'm gonna be able to just burst them since I'm not gonna have a uh, flash. I'm going to play down. If he walks up for this cannon, he's just dead. You can probably just dive him, honestly, though. Kind of a battle, but I'm just gonna send it. Never had much to say, but I'm sure glad we shut him up. I, mean, I don't really need you to be here, but whatever. An enemy has been slain. Uh An ally has yeah. been slain. I mean we we could have maybe actually looked. I don't know what I'm witnessing, but sure. What the fuck is this? Okay. I just got... three man, I guess. My bad. Yeah, I don't know what I'm witnessing. Uh, this is just your classic faster GM game, I guess, this season. Like, I actually don't know what is happening, but how you doing, so... But yeah, I don't know. I, I'm very confused. All my games set uh My first game back in, like, almost a week. Or first day back in, like, a week, and, like, all these games are, like, so weird. Players are just... There's something. Okay, we both have flash. I didn't risk space that, but... <laughs> we just dive him now. Get our hubris stacking. <laughs> this guy willingly blind pick like, first picked Aatrox. So, and he's playing like this. I don't know. I thought he'd be like maybe like a decent like Aatrox one trick or something. But like, I don't know what I'm witnessing. <laughs> Zayus, yeah. Something. I swear most Aatrox players on the server are just really bad. That's why whenever I see Aatrox, I'm always like, thank God, just screw I swear I never see this matchup. Always oh, just either like Udi or top or um Fiora and shit like that. It's NA, look at your pro players. I'm gonna do some okay top laners in NA that aren't bad, but I will say majority of them are definitely questionable. Then Renekton. I mean, I think with the Lethality build, if you can get items, yeah, I'd say Kled's pretty good right now in the mid to late game. Just because of how strong Lethality items are, and he can abuse them pretty well. Uh, probably not, no. I, I haven't really been playing much this season, if I'm being honest. Like, 
I just don't, I don't know. I never really like considering myself the best or whatever. But there's just a lot of like really, really good Kledmans, right? I definitely think Ana has the best Kledman, like most like consistent and just best Kledmans out of any server. But then again, I feel like Ana is like the only server that has Kledmans. I swear I've never seen Kled get picked on in other servers. There's a lot of like really solid clubs. But right now I'm nowhere. Like I'm I'm pretty washed, I'm not gonna lie. I'd say last season was probably my peak in terms of like mechanics and stuff. Right now I'm pretty meh. I just haven't had like the same motivation to like wanna grind the game this year. Like it's more just like playing for content and just chilling. I think it's more just the fact though that the meta just feels so shitty to like want to grind and also matchmaking and game quality is kind of shit. Oh wait, we're just flashing. Okay, I did not really want to do that, but okay. Like that's not worth, the guy has no gold or is not worth gold at all. We just use double flash for that. I guess it's about sending a message. But that was definitely not worth the guy's 0 5. <laughs> so aggressive, yeah. But like that, that definitely is not worth, but. Small dirty, barely patch again, yeah. I don't think it's gonna affect me too much. Cause like, I usually just sit on long swords anyways, early on. Like I usually don't buy it like Rush Dirk. I mean, I, I, I do think Dirk Rush is nice, but... I'm usually just sitting on components anyways, like pickaxe and long swords and stuff, so... It's not really gonna affect me too, too much. Cause they're not nerfing the actual items when you finish them, it's just the components for it. The Caulfield's one is a little unfortunate though. Read your chat. I am reading it. I, I think Assassin's usually better than Berserker. Yeah. Just because there's there's so much max percent max health damage in the game, and also with the audio items are just very strong right now. Jared. Kind of a battle actually. Oh, he didn't die? Oh, thank you, Zolimer, by the way. What is this game, by the way? Like, this is actually such a grief game. I can't focus. <laughs> it's actually, like, just so troll playing in the server, man. Like, what, what, what is happening? I can maybe kill him, actually. Actually, no, he has too much armor. Did I go 4 or 5 long swords instead? Yeah, that's what I was thinking as well. Oh, wait, we just randomly into the McKill. Introduction on Iceborne, yeah, I mean, that item was just literally just the most opportune item in the game last season. <laughs> like, champions like Cassante, once I got that, it doesn't matter if he's 0 10, like, you can literally just kill anything. But then again, Cassante was also just bullshit in general last season. But yeah, that item was so cringe when it had, like, the ex free exhaust on the item. For how cheap it was, too. Alright, we'll, we'll pick up this and then we'll go... Do I want to ult here? Eh. Really. Nah. 
I wasn't going to, but it's Huber stock, so I guess it's fine. Just walk bot here. Which is actually pretty noticeable, yeah. I haven't really played against them much since they did the change, so I haven't really gotten to like get too much, but it does feel nice for sure, because I feel like there it was actually a pretty high chance in the previous patch where I'd probably get pulled, even though I shouldn't have. Just push the Raven. I guess that's fine. Ah, I trolled. My bad. I didn't expect the Volleybear to just be chilling there, to be honest. Uh, he had Frozen Heart, that's why I can auto right away. Okay, though, they, they, they nerfed it by 100 gold and 5 armor. The enemy's gutted. Edge of Night Rush? Yeah, I have no idea. Apparently it's kind of working though, he's kind of just shitting on my bot somehow. Maybe it's a new tech. Yeah, my team's kind of getting cucked actually. I might actually have to go Serpents here. I think we go Mortal into Serpents maybe. I probably forgot Clud existed. I mean, I feel like ever since they released Clud, they've forgotten about him, right? <laughs> Most all in champ. I mean, yeah, that's how this whole kit's been designed around, right? One of the healthier kits too, because he actually has like a strong point in the game and a weakness, right? He's not one of those champions that can just like sit back and do nothing and like just scale and be Thanos and also have a strong early game, right? He's a champion where you actually have to like pressure and get leads. And if you fall behind like, then your champion's not gonna be that relevant unless obviously you can somehow get back into the game. Hey, good morning, up so. Oh my god, where'd she go? Ah, oh, thought I didn't have to keep off. Alright, whatever. We'll take it anyways. I can't move. I'm dead. I'm getting murdered by the Iceborne, uh... Frozen Heart, Holy Bear. I'm up. It's crazy. This game is actually still like gonna be a little tricky to play. You know, I'm like super fed. It's because my team's kind of running it a bit, but or just what two and thirteen? I didn't realize. Serpents. Yeah, I'm thinking going serpents fourth or fifth item here. And then I'll go like opportunity last probably. I do not want my land taken. I want them unruly and free. Okay, bro. Oh wait, he actually got out. I'm free thing. Wait, I'm just dead. Oh, I am trolling. I should have just led with ult if I was gonna do that. I didn't think he had flash to be honest. Okay, I'm trolling. I'm like so autopilot. I actually do the stop trolling. I got greedy going for the wave. I thought my uh 
Profan would just one-shot it, to be honest, though. I'm kind of surprised I didn't just one-shot the wave with Profan. Like, I'm four items at 20. But I, I guess it's... How much is... I mean, you can just Baron here if they kill. I swear with these type of games though, it's like so hard to like actually like play correctly because like the game is just like so all over the place. And I just feel so cruel to like actually try to play correctly. Like you're just kind of like forced into like playing worse. But the lamb, yeah. I mean, I guess it can be, like, maybe enjoyable sometimes, like, if you're just able to, like, one-shot them on repeat and, like, have no threat. But if they have some, like, really annoying champions on, it can be pretty frustrating. Oh, I'm trolling. Wow, I'm playing so bad. <laughs> I'm missing everything now. I missed my EQ for no reason. But that was another play where if I just lead with ult, I just kill her. But I would try to go for the EQ first. You are my tranquility. I was getting too greedy with my combos. Wait, what? My E didn't go off. Okay, the Nautilus. Holy, this Nautilus is just shitting on them. But still regardless, yeah. Pretty annoying. Oh my god, I almost died. Always go crown now? No, I don't go hubris on every game. I, I just do it in games where like I'm snowballing and I know I'm just gonna take over it. Like if it's in like a more evened out game where like I don't think I'm gonna actually like get a ton of value from it early, I usually won't rush it, but I think in games like this where like I'm already like so far ahead and it's also just a really like flippy game where like I know I'm just gonna have like a ton of fighting and shit, but I think it's fine too. I didn't want to have to ult here, but... Bro, I'm missing every Q. I'm playing so bad. Oh wait, my 4th auto need to go off. I thought I had my 4th auto stacked already. Oops. Uh... Nautilus? Uh... I can't really help you there, bro. I'm sorry. I'm playing so bad though, man. <laughs> Like my mechanics are so sloppy now. I'll just steep you. We can probably end here. Or actually... Eh. I can't move. Wait, what? I thought, um... I more of a wave. Goodbye, world. Oops. Whatever, we get both turrets, it's worth. All in a day's work, you know, just, just get every turret for our life. And we have our full build now, too. We'll take it. Six items at 24. Not bad. Oh, you look like I did so much damage earlier, yeah. 
I was actually like, what the fuck? What's he even have? Support items. Oh. I honestly still don't even know what the support items do. Produce incoming damage for two seconds after taking damage. What? Does he have to hit them for this, or does it just if he gets hit by a champion, then the next two seconds he just takes reduced damage from that champion? And then slow nearby enemies for 60%. Yeah, there's one turret left. Like old AP crown? Ah, oh, I see. I see. Alright, let's just end this shit. I should just be able to one shot anyone I like, have a hundred of out here. I kind of honestly still want to this game over Mortal, but I think Mortal has pretty good value because of... I'm just going to one-shot this down here. Goodbye, Jared. I'm sorry. Thundered Aatrox rushes so bad, yeah.